Tesla's latest release is about to revolutionize the automotive industry and you are getting a front row seat. Felix Sayer, your guide through this technological marvel. And today we're diving deep into Tesla's game-changing announcements that are sending shockwaves through Wall Street and their competitors. From groundbreaking full self-driving capabilities to the unveiling of their highly anticipated robo-taxi, we're going to cover it all. And let me tell you, the numbers we're seeing, they're nothing short of extraordinary. Now, I must confess, my golden retriever Winston tried to sniff out some insider information for us, but his nose let him stray to street jar instead. Uh, but no worries, we've dug up all the good stuff. So as we embark on this journey through Tesla's latest advancements and what you need to expect from the coming RoboTaxi event, we'll explore how these innovations are impacting Tesla's market position and what it means for the future of transportation and the stock price. But instead of the future, let's take a step back to examine how our teaching portfolio has seen remarkable gains this year. Yes, we're up 93% so far this year. That is a $28,000 gain on a $30,000 portfolio. Intrigued? Well, I'm hosting a beginner boot camp this coming week, and I'm going to teach you how we achieve these results. All you've got to do is head over to felixfrenz.org slash bootcamp and grab your spot and be part of the million people we're planning to make financially free here as part of our community. So let's dive into the heart of Tesla's tech prowess, their full self-driving system or FSD as it's commonly known. Now pay attention because this is where things get really, really fascinating. Tesla's just announced a new FSD update that's set to redefine autonomous driving. But before we explore these groundbreaking improvements, let's take a quick journey through FSD's development history. Tesla first introduced Autopilot back in 2014, which was essentially the precursor to FSD. By 2016, they'd unveiled Enhanced Autopilot and the concept of full self-driving. Fast forward to October 2020, and we saw the launch of the FSD beta testing program. Now in 2024, we're witnessing a quantum leap in FSD's capability. The upcoming 12.5.2 update is promising a threefold improvement in miles driven between necessary interventions. That means it's three times better than its predecessor. And if that wasn't impressive enough, the version 13 update scheduled for October is set to double that again, offering a six-fold improvement. But what does it mean in practical terms? Well, imagine your Tesla navigating complex highway scenarios with unprecedented smoothness or handling the city streets with the finesse of a seasoned driver. The end-to-end -end network for highway driving is a key focus, allowing for seamless transitions between different driving conditions. And one of the most intriguing additions is the new eye tracking feature. This replaces the previous steering wheel torque detection system, ensuring drivers remain alert while using FSD. It's a significant step towards enhancing safety and reliability and to please regulators. But let's not forget about the integration of the AI3 computer. This technological marvel is set to enhance the vehicle's processing capabilities, allowing for more complex decision-making in autonomous driving. And the numbers behind this technology are just staggering. Tesla vehicles have now covered a mind-boggling half a billion miles using FSD better. That's a treasure trove of real-world data that's being used to refine and enhance these AI-driven systems. But as we look to the future now, Tesla isn't stopping here. They're already planning to expand FSD capabilities into international markets like Europe and China, pending regulatory approvals. The implications of these advancements are profound, not just for Tesla owners, but for the entire automotive industry and urban planning. We're on the cusp of a transportation revolution and Tesla is leading the charge. So let's shift gears to what might be the most anticipated event in Tesla's calendar this year or maybe this decade, the unveiling of their robo-taxi on October 10th. And trust me, this isn't just another product launch like the sort of nonsense that Apple just put out. It is a real glimpse into the future of transportation. Tesla's chosen quite an unconventional venue for this reveal, the Warner Brother Studios in Burbank, California. It's a far cry from their usual locations like the Gigafactory in Texas or the design studio in Hawthorne. But there is method to this madness, and it's brilliant. 
You see, this Hollywood studio offers Tesla a controlled yet realistic environment. They can showcase the autonomous driving capabilities on simulated city streets, mimicking real-world scenarios without the unpredictability of public traffic. It's like having a giant high-tech playground to demonstrate the robotaxi's prowess. Now, this event was originally scheduled for August 8th, but Elon Musk requested some design changes and the stock dropped on the announcement, oh my God, delays, no, but this delay might actually work in our favor. Why? Well, it's given the team more time to refine the prototypes and potentially introduce new features or technologies during that presentation. So what can we expect to see? Well, if I were a betting man, and as a former banker, I've learned a thing or two about calculated risks and betting is not one thing I do, but I would wager on live demonstrations of the robotaxis autonomous driving technology. We might even see attendees taking rides in fully autonomous vehicles, though likely with a driver present just to the, to the regulatory constraints. Although given that it's a private lot, maybe they can get away with it. We'll see. But that's not it. There is speculation that Tesla might unveil wireless charging capabilities alongside the Robotax. And this aligns perfectly with Musk's vision of integrating advanced technologies into Tesla's lineup. Imagine a future where your Robotaxi can simply park over a charging pad to juice up between the rides. It's the stuff of science fiction, but Tesla is making it a reality. In fact, there are even concepts being tested where the road will provide the electricity, which is kind of like what we had when we had trams, right? So you could get to a place where certain highways or certain streets that are popular actually charge your car. But back to the event, which isn't just about showcasing a new product. It's about demonstrating Tesla's commitment to advancing autonomous vehicle technology. It's a statement to investors, competitors, and the public that Tesla is at the forefront of this transportation revolution. And the implications are insanely far-reaching. We're talking about reshaping urban transportation, reducing congestion, and even changing the way we think about car ownership. It's a very, very bold vision. And on October 10th, we'll see just how close Tesla is to making it a reality. Now let's turn our attention to the exciting new features Tesla is rolling out across its vehicle lineup. And while we've recently delved into the actually smart summon feature, short ASS, yes, um, there is still plenty of groundbreaking technology to explore. I think Elon really does have a sense of humor, doesn't he? So let's start with the cyber track here. Tesla's bold foray into the pickup truck market. The latest update brings auto park functionality to this ginormous car. And you might be thinking, well, parking a truck of this size can be a bit of a nightmare. Well, that's exactly what Tesla's just solved. This type of truck's auto park feature uses Tesla vision to navigate into parking spaces with precision. So it's not just about convenience, it's just about efficiency, right? Sometimes these car parking spots are just so tight you wouldn't want to park in it, but you press a button, done. And it removes one of the biggest Reasons that people don't want to buy a car that size in a city because they think it's going to be really hard to park. Well, if it does the parking for, for you, then what are you going to worry about? But it isn't stopping there. The upcoming version 13 update to FSD is set to introduce even more autonomous driving capabilities, particularly with parking and maneuvering. And one of the most intriguing additions is the ability for FSD to handle unparking, parking, and reversing autonomously. And that means your Tesla will be able to back out of a car parking space, navigate through a parking lot, and find a new spot, all without your intervention. So if you've ever parked in a spot so tight that you had to climb through the roof, which happens in Europe when I park there, um, you don't have to do that anymore. <laughs> or you know, you have to let your, your passenger out and say, would you mind getting out, darling? I have to park this thing in here, and then you squeeze out and do that whole thing. That's a thing of the past. But let's put the whole thing into perspective here. Imagine you're at a shopping center, arms full of bags, been shopping like mad, doing your bit to you know, ensure the soft landing is coming. Instead of trudging through the car park, you simply summon your Tesla. It unparks itself, navigates to your location, and then finds a new parking spot once you've loaded your shopping. So that's kind of a nice trick, really, isn't it? It's sort of like valet parking on speed. But this isn't just about convenience, this is also about safety. By removing human error from these often tricky maneuvers, Tesla is reducing the risk of those minor bumps and scrapes that are all too common in parking lots. So let's dive into 
the heart of this and what actually drives it. The AI and cutting edge technology behind it. This is where Tesla actually sets itself apart from the competition. At the core of Tesla's AI revolution is the integration of the AI3 computer. This isn't just an incremental upgrade, it's a quantum leap in processing power. The AI3 computer is designed to handle the complex calculations required for advanced autonomous driving. But what does that actually mean? Well, imagine your Tesla making split-second decisions based on a multitude of factors. Road conditions, other vehicles, pedestrians, even predicting potential hazards before they occur. You know, dogs, squirrels, pigeons, the whole lot. That's what AI3 does. Now let's talk about Dojo, Tesla's supercomputer that's actually revolutionizing the full self-driving technology development. Dojo is a beast. It's custom built to train neural networks at an unprecedented scale. To put it in perspective, Dojo can process millions of video frames per second. And this allows Tesla to simulate countless scenarios training their AI to handle virtually any situation it might encounter. And the results do speak for themselves, right? FSD Beta has now covered an astounding half a billion miles. That's the equivalent of driving from Earth to Mars and back. Twice. This massive real-world data set is invaluable for refining and improving the FSD system. And much like ChatGPT was ahead because they processed the most data, Tesla is ahead, but it's even harder to do. Because if you're one of Amazon or someone like that and you're building Claude or some other ChatGPT competitor, well, you just process all the news out there and all the Google indexed websites and you've got all the data, right? But how do you get driving data? You gotta get cars on the road. You gotta get sensors in them and cameras in them. How are you gonna do that? No one can actually do that. So the reality is that it's gonna get harder and harder and then completely impossible for the competition to catch up with Tesla. And I know some people are saying, well, Tesla's revenue is not growing as much. They lost a little bit of market share in the US. It's true. But market share is 49.7%. <laughs> that's, that's half the market. And yes, there'll be competition. There'll be other people. There'll be people, I don't want to drive the thing that everyone's driving. That's just part of like the market. That's okay. But if you look at Tesla's revenue growth, it's been growing at a compound annual growth rate of a 30% in the past five years. That's the kind of growth that makes investors sit up and go, wow, what do they do? In Europe, Model Y has become the best-selling car across all categories, not just EVs. This is Europe, the home of, you know, Volkswagen and BMW and Mercedes and all the French brands and, you know, all those brands are there. They tend to be quite domestically focused. They want to buy something built in their country. Well, Model Y has done it. It's outselling traditional fa favorites like the Volkswagen Golf. Um, Volkswagen is now really seriously in trouble. So what are Tesla's ambitions and projections? Well, they're ambitious. They're aiming for a 50% average annual growth in vehicle deliveries over a multi-year horizon. And if achieved, this would put Tesla in a league of its own in the automotive industry. It would be by far the largest car company ever. So as we wrap up this deep dive into Tesla's latest innovations and market performance, it's clear that we're witnessing a pivotal moment in automotive history from groundbreaking full self-driving to the imminent unveiling of the robo-taxi, Tesla is not just surviving, but it's thriving in an industry that is basically struggling with Tesla. And the road ahead will have some challenges, but based on these numbers and based on the plans and the projects, and we haven't even touched, you know, energy and AI and robots and any of that, Tesla seems to me incredibly well equipped to navigate them. So stick around with us, stay informed on what's going to happen here. We'll, of course, cover the uh, RoboTaxi event. Um, there is, of course, always the thought, uh, buy the rumor, sell the news. Um, events like this don't always have the promise necessarily of driving the stock price higher. Uh, but I think this is probably the one that has, in my opinion, the highest chance of actually doing that if they deliver what I hope they're going to deliver. Of course, that's not financial advice. It's just the opinion of me and my little dog here. But... Before we part ways, let me remind you that the key thing is, as an investor, is to manage your risks and manage your setup in a systematic way. Emotions are going to lead to tears. So come and join us this coming week for a beginner boot camp, and I'll teach you our three-step system, how we find trades, how we automate the risk management, and how we automate profit management so that you can just set it up and forget about it and 
do live your life and just do this in a couple of hours a week. And it's that system that's got us up 93% so far this year. And I do all of those traits. Most of those traits, I do them live and I share every single one with you guys. So you can see what I do. Um, so we can, you can learn. You can learn from us. So come and join us. Link is down below. Felix Renzelog slash bootcamp. And I love you for watching. If you found this video somewhat interesting, useful, intriguing um, or not, let me know down below and perhaps share it with a friend. I wish you all the best. What Tesla just announced is not your average corporate announcement. Picture this, a supercomputer with a processing power of 100,000 NVIDIA H100 chips built in just 122 days.